Good morning, boys and girls. Today we're going to go through and we're going to just review some place value. Place value is like the base of all math because it revolves around the digits and how much they're worth. So I want you to take a minute and look at the place value chart. Hopefully this looks familiar to you. Starting on the right, we have the ones place, which is obviously the smallest place value. And this year we're going to focus on all these digits up to the millions place. As we know, place value continues to grow. We have 10 millions, 100 millions, billions, and it gets bigger. Um, but this year, we're just going to focus from the ones all the way to the millions. So I want you to take a second. You can pause your video and look at the place value chart, and then maybe kind of like quiz yourself and see if you know them without looking. All right, today's goal is you will be able to accurately read and understand the value of numbers. Um, so that's what we're going to accomplish today during math. What I'd like you to do is first, let's just practice reading numbers. So I want you to practice by whispering it to yourself. The number is 1,364. I read a number looking at the biggest place value first, and then I go from left to right. So I have a one in the thousands place, 1,364. You try. Good. Let's try another one. You try this one first, and then I will um, say what it is. So whisper it to yourself. Awesome, you should have 19,628. 19 in the thousand, 628. What I wanna do is I'm gonna do mine. I have the I do, and then you're the you do. So wait and listen to mine, and then you can go ahead and practice reading yours. This is written in standard form. Standard form is just that typical way that we see numbers. I want you to whisper to yourself, standard form. Go ahead. Awesome, so my number is there's 45 in the thousands place. So I say 45,297. Go ahead and read yours to yourself. And you should have 29,364. Now, another way we can see numbers is written in word form. So this is similar. Um, it's just they're using words, where the other ones we are using digits. So on mine, I have 3,718. So if I was going to write this in standard form, I'd have 3,718. I want you to take a second and on your whiteboard, try to write seven, oh, I was gonna read it for you, write yours. And then we'll go over it on your whiteboard. you should have 7,912. What I wanna remind you is how they have the commas in the word form is exactly where they'll go in standard form. So after the 3,000, there's a comma. So when I write that after my 3,000, I also have a comma, okay? I gave you a challenging question here. I just want you to try it. No harm if you get it wrong. No prizes if you get it right. I'm going to read it. It's in word form. And I want you to try on your whiteboard to write it in standard form. Here we go. Listen up. 1,742,806. I'm going to read it one more time. 1,742,806. So if I was going to write this in standard form, I should probably give you a second. Why don't you take a second? and try it yourself. All right, so you should have 1,742,806. If you got it, awesome job. If you didn't, that's okay too. We're still 
reviewing. Another way um, we could do it is just simply, I wanted you to do this on your, on your, all by yourself. So I'll read it to you and then you can write it. You can do it on your whiteboard or you can write right on the screen. So 2,406. 2,406. 2,406. Notice that I didn't say 06. When there's a zero, it's the same as nothing. So I didn't have to write anything there. All right, to end today's lesson, what I'd like you to do is I filled in, here's the place value chart. I already filled in the ones place, the hundreds and the thousands. Um, using your pen, I want you to, I don't think you can drag, you can try, but I don't think you can, um, write in the missing place values. Also, you need to have a spot for commas, okay? So you're filling in the place value chart using your pen or however you want to do it. Maybe you want to rewrite it all out on your whiteboard, whatever works for you. But I want um, your place value chart filled out with commas. All right, guys, good luck.